all right you guys so this reading will be for my aries aries sun moon rising and venus signs all right aries okay aries we're gonna see what's going on with you guys in the month of november Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. All right, Aries. We're going to see what's going on, okay? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus sign. What's going on for my Aries? In the month of November. Oh, the King of Pentacles wanted to pop out. We got here the strength, Okay. I'm saying like Aries, you could be dealing with a Leo energy, okay? A fire sign such as yourself. So the strength talks about keep going, okay? Keep trying, okay? I'm saying like you're transforming into a beast, okay? I'm also seeing hard work pays off. With this strength here. Watch out for the number 888 because I'm saying abundance could be coming your way. Money flowing, coming your way. We have here the strength, okay? Somebody got a cat. <laughs> Somebody got a cat or, you know, a dog. I'm, I'm just saying an animal here. It doesn't have to be. But I'm saying it's that, you know, hard work is going to pay off. Your hard work is going to pay off in the month of November, which is this month, y'all. Okay, it's almost time for Thanksgiving. You get what I'm saying? Thanksgiving is, is, is going to be here in no time. Thanksgiving is going to be here in the next two weeks, y'all. Like, can't you believe it? Like, this year is almost all the way. <laughs> Tell me more about this strength here for my Aries. I'm also seeing that it's trying to stay strong. You're going to be trying to, find, trying to find different ways to stay strong here. Tell me more about the strength. We got here the Haman. So I'm saying like you also could be dealing with a Pisces or a Cancer, okay? There's a Pisces, a Cancer around you. So this talks about looking at things from a different perspective with the Haman. Watch out for the number 12, okay? I'm saying like you need to rearrange. I'm, I'm saying like rearranging things in your house, your home. Okay, taking the time out to reflect. Even if, if this is a relationship, Aries, you're going to be taking the time out to reflect on that relationship in the month of November. Okay, seeing what you actually want. Seeing what, you know, if this is something where you want to be. Okay, you're, it's just like you're overanalyzing a situation here. Okay, but you're a beast here. Okay, it's like a, a shed of the old you into the new you here. I'm saying like you're transforming into this lion, okay? All because you look you looked at things from a different perspective with this hey man. Yeah, I'm telling you, I'm saying like Pisces, Cancer, Cancer, Pisces, Leo, such as yourself. Tell me more about this hey man. Tell me more about the hey man. Ooh, we got the ace of wands. So I'm I'm telling you. I almost called you Leo, okay, you guys? Okay, I'm telling you, Aries, there's something that you're going to be doing, working hard on, okay? And we got here the higher fit right here. So you could be dealing with a Taurus energy, Taurus around you, this earth sign around you. Like I said, a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. This could be in a moon, Venus, a rising here. But we have here the Ace of Wands. So this Ace of Wands is about new passion, a new opportunity, okay? You're opening new doors. All right, Aries, that's what I'm saying. You're opening new doors to abundance here, okay? All because you kept trying. All because you kept going here, okay? you It's just like all because you didn't give up. I'm seeing like a reward that's happening. Okay, we're going to clarify this Ace of Wands. Why is the Ace of Wands here? Tell me more about this Ace of Wands. Because I'm saying, like, Aries, you were stuck. Yeah, you were stuck with this hey man. You were very much stuck, didn't, didn't know which way to go. But I'm saying it's just like, Aries, this month, you're going to be putting in the hard work, the necessary 
work in order to make something happen in order for you know things to go in your favor here that's what i'm saying like i'm saying like stuff will will flow in your favor okay we got here the ten of wands so something you had to move away i'm saying like literally moving something was too much of a burden for you to deal with okay something was draining you out burning you out here you was very much burned out with this Ten of Wands. Yeah, this is you. And this is something like you had to move away from in order to receive happiness, in order re to receive joy here with this Ten of Wands energy. Tell me more about this for my Aries. Tell me more about this Ten of Wands. Sister of Souls, yeah, Aries, this is what I'm saying, you you had to move away from something that was no longer serving you, okay, okay, we have here the strength, so it's just like, you did, you're gonna be doing the stuff that you have to do, give me one card, please, you could also be dealing with a air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. You're definitely dealing with another fire sign here, okay? So your your abundance, your happiness. Oh, I'm saying like something you love this month, okay, Aries. That's going to show up for you and it's going to show out for you, okay, y'all. So we're going to clarify more deep about this. Tell me more about this strength. Tell me more about this strength. Guess what? The Ten of Wands again, y'all. The Ten of Wands popped out again. So something was definitely a burden. It's no longer going to be a burden anymore. I'm saying like, Aries, you're going to be experiencing happiness. I'm saying like you had to move away from this love connection, this job. You know, just, just to focus on you. about this ten of wands because then we have here the sun here and this brings in joy happiness excitement and it's paired with the ace of wands here okay aries so this is good tell me more about this ten of wands tell me more tell me more about this what was the burden what was causing things to be stagnant with the hey man yeah the hangman is all about stagnation, y'all. Tell me more about this Ten of Wands. Why is the Ten of Wands here? So, things wasn't manifesting in your life. Things wasn't going in your favor. Money was, start, was starting to get low here. The things that you asked for and, and, and the things that you was praying for, it wasn't coming in, okay? That's what I'm seeing. But what I'm seeing is like, there's a new opportunity. I'm telling you, Aries, I'm seeing like hella opportunities coming your way. Amazing opportunities flowing your way with this Ace of Pentacles energy. This is going to be good. This is a fresh new start. And what I'm seeing, it, it's going to bring in this Ten of Pentacles. Okay, you're no longer being stuck. Okay, so many opportunities is coming your way. Okay, all because you didn't give up. All because you kept trying. Okay, I'm also seeing that if you was feeling like sick, Aries, you're going to be feeling better. Your health is going to start to get better here. Okay, but I'm seeing like, you know, this ruckus. This ruckus that you had, especially in the month of October. Things, you know, it was kind of rocky. This month of November is going to bring in opportunity, opportunities, growth, stability here, or a fresh new start, or opportunity for a fresh new start. And I'm saying, like, something could lead to the Ten of Pentacles, okay? Especially if you're dealing with someone, I'm saying things are going to get better for you and this person in the month of November, y'all. This is something that you're going to be happy about. This is something that you're going to be excited about. Like I said, you could be dealing with a Taurus Virgo Capricorn energy that's coming in. Doesn't have to be, y'all. Doesn't have to be. But you're going to be jumping up for joy when it comes down to this. And then we got here the Queen of Cups. So, yeah. You're not, you're not having unfulfillment dreams no more. Your wishes will be fulfilled. Tell me more about this sun. So you're going to be happy here. Okay? Like I said, you could be dealing with this 
this this air sign Gemini, Gemini Libra Aquarius why is the eight of swords here why is the eight of swords I'm seeing fear we got the two of ones reverse so this talks about you know it's just like if there was a choice in the past you're not making a choice well, you, you made a choice now in the month of November. But when I'm seeing in the past, there was a choice that had to be.